Welcome back to Theme Park Wizard. We finished all our Epic Universe coverage lately. There's been a lot, but now time to turn our attention to the other project going at Universal Studios Florida. And these photos are thanks to Bio Reconstruct. This is the DreamWorks project. Um, we're getting another update on this. This should be, we should have an opening date for this announced pretty soon, I think, because it's supposed to open this year, preferably th probably the, this summer. And it's already February, so hopefully soon we'll get an opening date for this new land. But here's a nice aerial shot, and you see things are progressing quite nicely. Uh, there'll be no new actual rides here, just a retheme of the troller coaster, but there'll be a lot of new play areas and elaborate meet and greets. So let's get into that right now. So we're going to start with, there's there's four areas here. There's Shrek, Kung Fu Panda, Trolls, and what I call the Central Courtyard, because I'm not sure what type of name, name that is. I think it's just going to be a whole DreamWorks area. So this is, we're going to start with the Central Courtyard area. And you can see there's Shrek's house, but we'll get to that later. And of course, there's E.T. right behind there to get a, a perspective of where everything is. This is new Central Play area being built that I'm sure will be heavily themed to different DreamWorks characters or DreamWorks property. That does have its own little mini land in this land. Now... This play area is, I like the color, the color scheme looks pretty nice, pretty kind of woodsy and, and brown, but it's progressed quite nicely. There's some bridges and there's like a, a whole jungle gym being built and even some nice trees, which is cool. A lot more progress, a um, lot more built up than the last update. And there's even a small tree stump with, it looks like a potential maybe walking path. There's a bridge, oh, there's going to be a walking path because it's the bridge to the tree stump, which... Could this be a slide, actually? I'm curious if that what that's going to be. Um, let me know in the comments below if you know what that could be. But yeah, there's this whole little bridge, little explorer area. And it's actually quite a large jungle gym. And there's the troller coaster to the bottom of the picture. But pretty cool looking stuff. Here's a ground level view of this play structure with the troller coaster's first drop in the background. You can see there's some wood on the side of the fence there. That will obviously is temporary. There will be uh, that will be uninstalled and taken away soon when the bridge is complete but this will be a nice little gateway because i assume you'll be able to walk under the bridge um to the play structure and that could be like um a nice little little gateway to this mini land here taking a large overview of the troller coaster the kung fu panda area but really that sent the central courtyard where again i'm sure there'll be a whole bunch of meet and greets and just different the themed dreamworks properties but i really like all the trees here so many trees, and I'm sure there's even some new seating areas being built. You can see some concrete, for, well, not in this photo, but in a different photo from Bio Reconstruct, you can see a different, uh, the, one of those conc uh, concrete pouring one of those benches there, which looks fantastic. And the nice, again, for putting, again, more park back in the theme park, just like uh, theme parks seem to be doing, which is fantastic. And a lot more places to sit, more trees. I absolutely adore it. Um, speaking of adoring, I love Kanku Pan as well. Kung Fu Panda is having a getting a new movie, Kung Fu Panda 4, coming out in exactly two or exactly one month from today, March 4th. And yeah, here's this play area. Massive indoor uh, indoor outdoor play area, looks like here. And hopefully, I hoping, hoping, hoping we get Mr. Ping's noodle shop here, but we'll certainly be having an elaborate meet and greet with Poe himself. So yes, next is this Lily Pan area. I'm not sure what uh, IP this is going to be themed too, but if you know, let me know in the comments below, but it's just a cute little lily pad area for the children who may be like even smaller, smaller uh, toddlers who can't play on the playground to play here and jump around and I'm sure the lily pads will change colors and and maybe even it'll be like shooting fountains, who knows, but at least probably they'll chill and change colors and, you know, uh, make sounds, so that'll be really cool as well. Looking over at the Shrek area, yeah, look at that. Shrek's house is getting its nice final coat of paint. This is the final theme, and he's even getting, getting some nice shrubbery. This will be, again, his meet and greet area, and it looks absolutely gorgeous. Just, I cannot wait to see this in person, and, and I, it just looks so real. Now, here's a close look at those trees and shrubbery that I was talking about. This is newly added um, greenery here to really you know, liven up the area and makes it make it feel lived in. I think it looks absolutely fantastic. And here's another shot from the ground of Shrek's uh, house being worked on. And there's some workers painting the top. I'm um, putting another, looks like a layer of weathering and paint on it to make it look, make it look like Shrek's tree stump straight from the movie. 
And lastly, here is the trailer coaster. Looks fantastic. I think this is just about complete. The station uh, roof is done. Although they may put, I mean, see how the, the one side has the rainbow colors and the other side does not. I wonder if they'll add the same rainbow colors on the other side or if that's just it. I feel like, I feel like there may be actually some more to do there, but I'm not sure. But the rest of the coaster looks complete and I'm not, I'm sure we'll probably see this testing soon. Because, I mean, if the rides at Epic Universe are already looking at, the coasters at Epic Universe are looking like this and already testing, then I'm sure Shiller Coaster, if not already, will soon be testing. And that is going to do it for this quick update for the DreamWorks land. I know you guys like this, these updates. I do as well. If you like this video, press that thumbs up and subscribe. And also, if you want to contribute to the channel for as low as $1 a month, you can check out the Patreon my patreon.com slash club722. You unlock early or uh, post to early video, uh, early access to videos just like this one. And special exclusive Patreon only posts like a new project tracker I'm doing for the Southern California projects. And if that's popular, I might do an Orlando one as well. But also cool permit posts and things that I just don't post on my YouTube channel. So definitely go check that out. It's patreon.com slash club722. Link is in the description below. And always have a very Shrek or Shrek horrific day.